There it is. Not much force required at all. Hey, it's Joel Walsman. We're back at my house and I've got a problem right here. You probably had the same problem before. I've had customers pay me big money to do this one thing for them. Like literally drive across town, 150 bucks to do this one thing. It only takes about two minutes. Let me show you what I mean. I've got a broken light bulb in this fixture. And there it is, broken light bulb. Now that will be really hazardous if the power is not turned off. In this case, I've got it unplugged. What I'm gonna do is use my insulated Milwaukee needle nose pliers. I'm gonna grab the shell and I'm gonna turn it. Oh, it is turning, there it comes. Boom, that's it. Now take a look, let me show you another way. Sometimes it's really jammed in there and it's tough. So if that's the case, those shells are very lightweight, flimsy metal. What you can do is you can grab the shell and instead of rotating it out, you're literally going to break it in on itself. You're going to grab the perimeter and just twist it in until eventually it comes loose or falls out. There it is. Not much force required at all. Now I've got my new bulb. And I always want to take a visual inspection to make sure nothing looks marred or damaged. If that uh, broken light bulb scenario is common for you, I'm going to drop a product in the description below. If your light bulbs are sticking in your sockets, use light bulb lube and they'll slide in and back out more easily. Especially recommendable if you have an outdoor installation. Now, just like any job, we want to try it when we're done. Let's we'll see if it lights up. It's made 150 bucks. Subscribe to Electric Pro Academy for real skills to make real money.